Good morning, everybody. Welcome back. Uh, we're gonna do a what I'm doing today video. Um, don't mind me, I look a hot mess. I am still feeling kind of gross. Um, I do have a cold. It's like just started and I can feel it in here in my throat. So bear with me if I start coughing. Okay, alrighty then. So, um, I, that's why I didn't record a floss tube yesterday. I was like really, um, my throat hurt to the point that every time I talked, I was, my voice was really, really scratchy. And I was like, yeah, that's not happening. So I apologize to those of you that waited patiently for the floss tube video. I, yeah, okay. So, excuse me, yesterday, um, I did do some stitching. I, uh, after I took some medicine, I um, sat and stitched and um, I, uh, I stitched on two projects yesterday. Now, um, the old Christmas tree, I do need to start that and I have planned to start that. When did I say I was gonna start it? Oh, let's see, the next project, let's see. Today, one, two, three, four. I'm gonna start it on Thursday. That's when I'm in the next rotation. So I stitched on Magic Book a little bit yesterday and then I started um, I restarted uh, one that I had a really long time ago and I had started it, but uh, I can't remember. I think, I don't, anyway, I didn't like the coverage that it was on. So I am starting it again and hold on and I'll find it. I'll show you a picture of it. Um, <clears throat> It's called Old World Map, and I've had this for a really long time, and um, why isn't it? <sighs> Seriously. But anyway, don't pay attention to what it says, but this is what it's gonna look like when it is done. And I started on it last night, and after I finished what I wanted to stitch on um, Magic Book, and then I restarted this. I also received a grime garb from Danielle. And um, it's got bees, but this is the restart. And I apologize for the, the, yeah. <laughs> I apologize for the, the see-through, but I restarted it. I started it, I'm at the top page, um, and I restarted it, as you guys can see, I restarted it, and that's where I'm at so far with it. And there's a lot of confetti in it, but it, it's a hate. What hate doesn't have confetti? So I um, restarted that, and um, I pulled the fabric from a project that I'm not going to do. So I, I said, you know what, instead of me waiting to buy fabric, I will, um, you know, do the, um, start it there. So I did that. Um, what else did I do yesterday? Um, I did start on, and 
I started watching uh, Star Trek Next um, Deep Space Nine and I'm on season two, I do believe. So I that, that I did that yesterday. Um, what else did we do yesterday? <sighs> Lord. Um, we stayed inside yesterday because it was really hot. It was awful yesterday. I didn't know it was going to be that hot. A little dude and I had to go to the store, and I didn't realize it was that hot. I was like, holy crap. So, yeah, it was very hot outside yesterday. It was like 90, it was like 90, but it felt like 98. I was like, holy, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, we stayed inside yesterday. It was not a pretty sight. And um, so I did finish, let's see, I know I finished a book. Um, let's see. national security which um, I know I started that but I finished that so today's Sunday okay I finished national security I keep forgetting it's Sunday not Saturday today. So, um, mm. there's like so many that I need to do. It's, it's crazy. Um, yeah, there's a whole thing of them that I need to finish on here, but, um, <sighs> all right, so I need to do that book. I need to finish the secret hours. Okay, so yeah, I, bear with me, I'm like out of it, and all right, so, um, and then I need to update my blog. I'll do that tomorrow. So, okay. Anyway, now for the stitching planner. I know I'm like all over the place this morning. I have, um, I really don't, I'm just like, I'm totally out of it. I don't. I still don't feel the greatest, and um, I'm just like uh, totally uh, out of it. And to top it off, uh, my son Justin called me yesterday and informed me that um, it's not anything that you know he's done or anything, but. He wanted to, you know, kind of put a bug in my ear that he might be moving back home in November. 
<coughs> oh, excuse me. And I was like, what? And he said, yeah. He said, I know it's gonna cause you problems. And I was like, what do you mean? And he's like, well, the rent's gonna go way up to the roof. And I said, probably. And I said, why? And uh, apparently, okay, they moved into this apartment and they were only supposed to be there until November. And then in November, they were gonna move to a bigger, I guess, house, apartment, something. And apparently that's not happening. Or I don't know, he said it's still up in the air. He's still got, you know, two or three months to figure that out. And he's like, I just wanna have all my ducks in a row and so forth. And I was like, well, I can't very well go over to the office because, you know, um, my apartment is income-based. It goes on income, my income. And um, I told him, I said, well, I'm not gonna like go over there and say, look, you know, he's moving back and then it not happen. And he says, well, what am I supposed to do? And I said, well, you need to figure out what everybody's doing. You all need to sit down, be adults about it and, um, you know, figure out what y'all are doing. And I said, because, you know, technically I don't have the room for you anymore. And he just sat there and he got real quiet. And he said, what do you mean? I said, well, your brother has kind of done his own little thing to the bedroom, you know, to y'all's bedroom. And I said, and we're getting ready to, you know, do all this stuff to his room. And he just sat there and he's like, well, what am I supposed to do? And I said, son, like I told you, you need to figure out what y'all are doing. I said, you've got two months to figure this out. I said, you know, if worse comes to worse, you know, you can move back here. It's not a big deal. And I can tell by the sound of his voice that he's, you know, stressing about it. And I told him, I said, don't stress about it. I said, you know, talk to your roommates, figure out what they're gonna do. Um, you don't have to call me every hour. Just kind of give me an idea, a heads up, what's going on, so I know what's going on. And he, you know, he says, I, of course, when he called me, the first words out of his mouth was, take it back, take what back, giving birth to me, put me back. I can't put you back. <laughs> Dude, you're going on 22 years old. I can't put you back. <laughs> it doesn't work that way. You're too big to go back into my belly. And well, I said, what's wrong? And he says, I just hate being an adult. And I said, well, can't help you there. <laughs> so, you know, he's, he's kind of, you can tell he's, you know, he's stressed. He's kind of ticked off about it. And I, I don't blame him because, you know, he's been doing really well for himself and he's, um, you know, he's done, he hasn't fallen on his face yet, but, um, He's like, this is gonna set me back. And I'm like, dude, you need to calm down and you all three need to sit down and figure it out. And he says, well, I flipped out and told him how I felt about the whole situation. And I was like, okay. I said, well, when you all calm down enough, you all need to sit down. You all need to, you know, get yourselves, you know, some kind of plan. And he says, well, I have a plan. It's just, they don't. And I said, okay, what is your plan? And his plan is he wants to stay and move out on his own. I'm like, well, you do realize that, you know, it's expensive as all get go out there. And um, so I said, then you need to sit down and tell them, you know, where you're coming from, how you feel and so forth. And he was like, well, can I basically tell them that you do and don't have room for me? And I was like, that's up to you. I mean, I'm not gonna turn you away, you're my kid. And so he's, you know, he's having growing pains. <laughs> and no, it's not his fault. And I, you know, I even offered to go over there and talk to them. And he's like, no, because that's gonna cause problems. And I'm like, well, what do you want me to do? Um, I don't know. 
So I guess I'm just kind of a sounding board. And because I'm mom, he wants me, he wants, you know, he, I don't know. He's upset and all sorts of stuff, which I can't say I blame him. So, you know, we're kind of, uh, we're kind of going with it. And I told him, I said, well, I, and I told, you know, and I told him, you know, what the rules were when he moved back in. And I said, I know you're an adult, but you need to realize some things. And he was like, what? I said, you can't be up all night long because if you're going to share a room with little dude, <coughs> little dude goes to bed at 10 o'clock and has to get up in the morning to go to get ready for school, even though it's virtual. And I said, and, um, you know, you're going to help me with bills. There's just no ifs, ands, or buts about that. And he was like, okay. So it, it's, yeah, he's, he's, he's like, I don't know. He's kind of, he's feeling lost. Let's put it that way. So you guys, you know, if you guys don't mind, you know, praying for him, maybe hopefully things can get resolved with those, with everybody over there. We'll see. All right, so today, I'm going to tell you. Um, today, well, I did stitch, I did stitch, I did do, you know, household stuff yesterday. Not a whole lot. Um, and then I ended up with a really, really bad headache yesterday. So I didn't do a whole lot. But um, today, I need to... Um, Miranda and I are going to fold clothes when she gets up. And then, sorry about my little rant. I didn't need to do that. Um, then, <sighs> what else? Um, need to check on the warmer in my room it's not I don't know it takes forever to melt I don't know if it's just if there's something wrong with it or if it's the outlet or what so I need to check on that so we need to check um, check on the warmer in my room because it's not um, it's I don't know what a steel is the light comes off and on and yeah I need to I think it's the, the outlet so we'll see um so let's see dishes of course always every day all right so then and then I'm gonna stitch on old world map and I added it to my wheel So, oh, goodness. All right. Um, trying to think if there's anything else that I need to do today because... Oh, man. I got something in my eye. Ah! Even though I just woke up, I'm like, not... Oh, I need to record plan with me with video which I will do later because later on when it's quiet I mean it's quiet now but um yeah all right let's see what else um
need to do these bobbins and put my full set of floss on them. I keep forgetting to pull them out. <laughs> and, and every time I, I pull out some bobbins, because I'm one of those ones that I'll just bobbin as I go when I'm doing a project. And of course, I, I need to get up off my bike <laughs> and get over myself and say, okay, because I have not been motivated the last couple of days because of, um, especially yesterday, because of um, this cold, because it made me feel like poop all day yesterday. And I didn't do um, a whole lot yesterday. I was like, you know what? I really don't care. And um, so, yeah. So, um, I just need to sit down and do this. And every time I think about, okay, I'm going to do it, I don't do it. I just get it. I just, you know, get started. And then, oh, yeah. Um, let's see. And then I need to fabric. or whatever you call them, square totes. I have one, but it's kind of messed up, but I need to get some more. All right, so now, Now, I will be doing a plan with me, and I will show you what I'm going to use. Um, those of you that saw my friend mail video, which I just moved, totally knocked everything over, um, which I gotta get that up. I'm going to use this in all three in my catch all, and my stitching, and my reading planner. But um, yeah. I'm going to use this. This is um, floral boxes, which I'm going to use. And I'm trying to decide if I want to go ahead and decorate, you know, with fall colors because it's, you know, fall's coming. And they have some really, really cool ones in here for fall. And like, um, I'm trying to think. Uh, well, they're not, it's not, come on, seriously. Um, I'm trying to see. Hold on. They have, she's got a, like all colors in here. So it's really, um, you know, one of those things where it's, it doesn't matter. I mean, I think these, these would be pretty for fall colors, but again, I don't know. I'm just going with it. Um, and there's all sorts in here and they're all floral, which is fine. And I'm thinking these are pretty cool. Aren't those pretty? So, um, yeah, that's what I'm going to use. All right, and let's see what else today. Hmm. I think that's all I'm doing today because I'm not, I don't, I don't really have a whole lot planned today because my plan was to sit and chill all day. And the rate I'm going, um, I might get that far <laughs> because I am, um, yeah, I'm less like really, really out of it. I'm tired and um, y'all gonna watch me do my, fix my hair. Um, I'm ready to like, I don't know, take a nap. I even know I, it's just this stupid cold. And um, yeah, and then going to the doctor, I have to wear a mask because they, uh, yeah, because of the COVID vibe vaccine. So, today's Sunday. All right. And it is 8.27. Okay. So, that is my day today. I'm not doing much else. I'm like, yeah. So, I hope everybody enjoys their day. 
I hope everybody has a great day and I will see everybody next time. And sorry, it's kind of rambling and all over the place, but I hope y'all have a good day and I'll see everybody next time. Bye everybody.